Hey guys, Chris again. I'm gonna go see the new Dragon Ball Super Broly movie in theater. Uh, when my friends show up, I got a few friends and they're on their way and uh, we're gonna go watch Dragon Ball Super Broly movie and I'll give you my reaction to it when I get back. It was really, really cool. I like some of the things they did. They changed the story. If you know anything about uh, what they were planning on doing, they, they uh, retconned Broly's backstory and Paragus, his father. They, uh, they gave Broly a lot more of a personality of like, uh, like a character, like, like he was a person and not just sort of a mindless beast like he was in the last one. I mean, uh, I'm gonna totally avoid spoiler spoilers. By the way, if you guys see this in theaters, uh, in Kansas it's gonna be out till Tuesday. Uh, it's like a super limited special showing. Um, if you go see it in theaters and they offer you these, uh, these little things, I'm not gonna show you what's on the other side of this, but it's a little card with a picture, and it's a huge, huge spoiler for the movie, and I was so angry. Then also this little, a little, a little baseball card thing that I'm not gonna show you. It's not a baseball card, but it's, it's a Dragon Ball card. It, it spoils a huge, huge thing that happens at the end of the movie, and they hand it to me right as I walked in, and I gave them my ticket. They handed me this huge fucking spoiler! I was so mad! Anyway, there were there were certain really cool things. The the animation is mostly really awesome. I love the way the the new um, the new animation looks when they when they really put in a lot of effort into the, like the battle scenes and stuff. Uh, this one got a little bit chaotic, like where it was really like hard to tell what was going on at certain points because it was it gets way over the top, like crazy wild, flashy just chaos and it's kind of hard to tell what's going on sometimes and it's just almost too much like if if i if i had just like slowed it down like like if if, if you if i buy this movie which i probably will I, i'm gonna have to watch certain parts in like slow motion just to even see what's happening because it's it's crazy and i'm not i know it's, it's blasphemy to be saying that it's like too much or too flashy or too you know chaotic or whatever when the animation is really really great it's just like whoa Whoa! Like hard to fucking follow. Uh, I didn't. I didn't like a couple of things that they did at the very end. It was mostly mostly pretty good. I I didn't care for some of the music during the battle. Uh, they kept like saying characters' names like over and over, like in the background, like Broly, 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 and then uh, Goku, go go Goku. And they like they kept saying the character's name in the background. I thought that was kind of silly, and yeah, I didn't really care for that. I, I, that that music I didn't care for. Most of the other like regular music was okay in it. I like the new the new look of Broly. He spends a lot of the battle um, in in like some regular new cool looking armor. Uh, they also they do a scene early in the movie where they do like a flashback and they kind of retell uh, you know the story of Frieza blowing up the Saiyans planet and they show like a young Vegeta and a young Raditz, which in in a very brief scene, little little kid Vegeta and kid Raditz look like chibi weirdos and they look like they don't really belong with the, the the rest of the scene I guess but uh it's pretty cool if you're a Dragon Ball fan I would go to the theater and see it while you still can but like I said it, as soon as that you give them your ticket and they offer you little little merchandise stuff I would say no I would just say I don't want it and keep you know just walk into the theater because it, they'll hand you some things like I'm happy to get merchandise and a little bit of swag you know but like don't hand me a spoiler right before I walk into the movie. Uh, anyway, that was my reaction, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Catch you later.